Hey guys, I uh, just wanted to keep you guys in the loop as to what's been going on in the last 48 hours um, and like why there wasn't a video on Wednesday and just in case you haven't seen the post I made on my Facebook or my Twitter um, just to let you guys know what happened um, and why there hasn't been a video or a stream and why the schedule might be a bit shaky <laughs> For a little while um so um this is going to be kind of different to any other vlog that i've done before because it's going to kind of be i don't know more casual if that's possible um so i'm kind of facing this way um for those of you who don't know what happened i had a little bit of an accident at home um which involved me going basically neck first into a brick half wall so um if you're a bit squeamish about injuries um probably isn't a good video <laughs> to watch so i'll sum it up briefly before i turn around and show you exactly what i did to my neck um so i i basically thankfully there's no severe damage like no permanent damage i did no damage to my artery in my neck i did no damage to my spine there's no skeletal damage at all which is quite frankly a miracle um it's i i got away very lucky i very easily could have very seriously hurt myself or even like i, I could have died <laughs> that's how bad the fall was <laughs> And um, going neck first into a, a brick wall, like a solid brick wall, don't recommend. But I'm trying not to think about that because it's not what happened. Um, I survived. I'm alive. Uh, I'm okay. I just have some bruises um, and some grazes. <laughs> and I got away with it. Very, very lucky. So, long story short, I'm okay. I'm just a bit sore, feeling very sorry for myself, and um, it kind of hurts to talk a bit, so that's why I'm kind of taking a break, because I think I've probably damaged some muscles in my neck, so to talk basically non-stop for a couple of hours in streams, or just even, you know, for a longer video I think would be hard, because even now it's starting to hurt just talking like this. So, anyway... I'll turn around now, so if you're squeamish about injuries, <laughs> um, it's worse, sorry, it's not as bad as it looks, um, and I don't personally think it looks that bad, but it's in a bad place. <laughs> so if you're squeamish, click off now, because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn around. So this is my neck. Um, yeah, I did, I did quite a number on it, and I, I don't think, personally, I don't think it's that bad. But I, I've been to a doctor and I've seen, well, I've heard what they've said to me and about like how it is right now. If this graze was anywhere else, you wouldn't think twice about it. It's just because it's on my neck that it looks bad. Like if that graze is on my knee or on my elbow or arm or leg or anything, it wouldn't, it would, it's a pretty nasty graze, but it wouldn't seem as bad. So I'm trying to think about it like that. Oh God, my hair's a mess. <laughs> Whatever. Whatever, I just wanted to keep you guys in the loop. I haven't really... I just kind of threw on this shirt. It's a new shirt, I like it. Um, <laughs> but, yeah, so I did quite a number on it. Um, I think I, like, cut my ear a bit as well. And um, I've got bruises on my knees and my arms. <laughs> I, I, I'm sure it looked spectacular. But um, we, have, we have slate flooring as well. So... I went like back of my head first into slate flooring, which knocked me unconscious, which is one of the reasons why it was particularly scary. Because I was home alone. Um, Josh was out at work and no one else was here. So um, I know from timestamps on messages that I was unconscious for three minutes. So the fact that I was unconscious for three minutes and didn't wind up with a concussion is also a miracle. Um, <laughs> So it's it's been a pretty scary 20, uh, 24 and 48 hours. Um, but 
thankfully, as I said at the start of the video, there's nothing serious. I don't want you guys to worry too much. Um, it's not as bad as it looks. Um, I'm just very sore, being very sorry for myself. I kind of just want to rest <laughs> my my neck and throat especially. So um, I won't ramble on too too much longer. Um, so I'm pretty sure that's all I really have to say. Um, yeah, there's, there's nothing serious coming of this. I, I just think I need to take it easy for a little while and I should be okay once, um, cause the biggest risk with this is just infection and it's been a couple of days. And um, it's looking pretty good for a grace. Like, there's no swelling or inflammation or any, like, signs of any infection or anything. So as far as I'm concerned, it should heal up fine. It shouldn't even scar. So um, it, should, it, should be, it should be fine. It's just, yeah, as I stated several times at this point, I'm sure, I'm just feeling pretty, pretty sorry for myself. Um, but I, I'm, I'm sh pretty sure... Like, I'm 90% sure everything should be okay. Unless this suddenly develops an infection, um, there shouldn't be any other adverse effects. I mean, I kind of jarred my shoulder again. For those of you who have followed the shoulder saga, because that was actually a neck problem in the end that was radiating down into my back and shoulder and arm. So, you know, smacking my neck hasn't really helped that at all. Um... So what was originally a bit of a flare-up for me being an idiot, using my LARP sword before I was ready to be practicing with it, um, turned into, like, you know, back to square one almost. But, oh well, such is life. Um, everything happens for a reason. Um, and I'm sure this was to teach me a lesson of some kind, probably that life's too short. Um, just remind me, because I've kind of forgotten that lately. Um, and yeah don't don't hesitate if there's things you want to do do them don't put things off till tomorrow that can be done today i think that's probably the lesson that i should take from this <laughs> um and i guess uh i'll just like finish on a uh on a note just be careful, um, particularly when climbing on things, uh, even more so when you're on your own. I would say if there's no one else around, don't climb on things. Just don't do it. Straight up, don't do it. It's bad. Um, you may have done it a million times. I think I said this in my Facebook post as well. Like You may have done it a million times. It only takes it going wrong once, and it can go wrong in a spectacular way. Because... Um, if, if no one's else is around and you take a nasty fall like I did, if if my if my fall had gone any worse, um like it could have been a lot more serious and with no one else around, um no one would have been there to help if I couldn't. Like if I stayed unconscious, um there would have been no one there to like do anything about it and i kind of would have just stayed there and that's a terrifying thought <laughs> but um thankfully that didn't happen but it very easily could have and hence why i'm saying be careful um and just yeah anything where you're climbing on things or climbing over things just be just be careful um i <laughs> i i love all of you and i i just yeah be safe Look after yourselves. <laughs> Don't pull a me. <laughs> um, but yeah, I reckon I'll just uh, I'll wrap this one up here, guys. So thank you so much for watching and for listening. Um, I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. It is it is Friday. I don't know if you're watching this today it came out or you're watching this perhaps later, but I hope you have a fantastic weekend. Um, and uh, don't know when I'll be uploading again. But, um, uh, I have a bunch of videos on my channel, you feel free to check out if you're new here. Um, and I did actually record an episode of Shadow of the Colossus before the accident, I just haven't got around to editing yet, so I might be able to get that out for maybe Monday. 
I'll try. Um, but we'll see. I don't know when the next video will be. I look forward to seeing you in that next video. <laughs> Bye! <laughs>